This is the second fingering for the Clark thumb drill. Practicing thumb position. <coughs> um, where the first fingering places the thumb on the octave harmonic, so the D and G string. Um, <coughs> we, for this second fingering, we shift our hand down a whole step towards the scroll and place our first finger, index finger, over the octave harmonic on the D and G string. So right now my first finger is on the D. I'm gonna press it down, the string against the fingerboard. My third finger is over E. My thumb is over F sharp on the D string. If I go to the G string, I have my first finger over the G and thumb over F sharp and third finger over A. So that's my notes I'm using. <clears throat> so here's the second fingering for the Clark thumb drill. press the string down to stop the note um, that's um, stopping the note before the bow draws the string to play that note <coughs> so I'm going to demonstrate again from a different angle Session that are on two different strings. Um, a lot of times I can keep one note down while having another finger down on the adjacent string. So, for example, when I play E to F sharp, I can keep my thumb down on the F sharp on the G string and my E down on the D string, and I can um, play those two notes without having to move any fingers. So that's nice. G to E. I can make that shape. Um, that's um, D with first finger to F sharp. So first finger and thumb are both down. So those are some key things to think about as you're practicing this. <coughs> 